Being sorry when you know the right thing to do. Well, we also know the right thing to do. Um, no, sir, no, sir, it doesn't come, it doesn't go into that. Actually, this one, sir, I, I woke up with serious running stomach. I, I was I was actually coming to work, then I got into this bus, uh, this bus. The driver refused to Mr. give me Obi, my sir, 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 it's the bus driver. Mr. Obi, just listen. Whether you have a running stomach or a flying stomach, we don't care. Because at this point, where you can no longer condone your nonchalant attitude towards work. You have to vacate this office immediately. No, sir. No, sir. No, no, no. No, sir. No. Sir, sir, I, 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 I'm always, sir, 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 I'm always punctual. I okay. don't, I don't, no, sir, you know now, it's, it's not possible. I was having running stomach, sir, 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 you're a human being. I was having running stomach, sir. Is the, is the boss ever that did not give me my chin? Sir, sir, is the boss ever that did not give me the chin, sir? Sir, sir. Jade Kriso. I beg Mickey go with him work. After all, he doesn't pay well. What is 70,000 Naira a month? But what do I do now? Akugo will eat me raw. How do I foot her bills? How do I take care of her? The most annoying part is that she doesn't even care what I do or how I make my money on a daily basis. All she cares about is spending money. Women and money. Should I tell Madame Angela about this? Won't she take advantage of it? <sighs> but she's my last bus stop. She is my last option. I have to meet her. Yes, I have to meet her. Come in. What is it? Obi, what is it? What is it, my friend? Why are you standing like I, that? I, I, I have been sacked. I've been sacked. I've been sacked. And, 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 it, and it, it, it's all your fault. Each time I said, Madam, let's hurry up and, so that I can go back to work. You, you will refuse. I keep saying, I say with all form of politeness, I, I, Madam, hurry up. Let me go back to work. You refuse. That means I've been sacked. <laughs> Let me have it. <laughs> oh, 
It hurts, right? Little. Relax, you'll be fine. Madam, I, I don't understand why you're laughing. You're Sit laughing. Down. You're laughing. Madam, I just told you that. I, I, I just gave you my sacklet. I've been, I've been sacked and, and you're laughing. I don't know if you planned this. If, if, if your plan it has worked, you, you can laugh. Sit down. Sit. Sit down, my friend. Sit. <laughs> it calls for celebration. Madam, my sack, my my my, my sack letter cannot call for celebration. I just told you that I've been sacked. I I don't know. I don't I don't know why we celebrate over sack letter. What do you even need that job for? A job that pays you nothing but peanuts, peanuts. As cute as you are, peanuts. Relax. I'll pay you 150,000 naira per month. <laughs> Look at the way he's looking at me. <laughs> Madam, wait, wait, wait. Did, 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 did. Obina, I've always wanted you all to myself. Myself. Alone myself. Hey, madam, did you just say you were going to pay me 150,000 naira? Not only that, I will also give you weekly allowance of 30,000 naira on top. Oh my god. Oh, huh? Oh my God. Thank you. Oh, come on. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. You know, you know this, every disappointment is a blessing. Thank you, ma'am. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you, ma'am. God bless you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Relax. Come on. No! Madam, no, no, no! No, 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 no. I'm so sorry. I guess I was so excited. I'm sorry. All right. Okay, fine. Let's go out. Okay? Take me downtown. Have my drink. Come on. Look at what you're doing. Relax, I'll pay for you. Come, let's go. Thank you, ma'am. Madam, I, I thought we were going to the female section. No, I'm shopping for you. A female? Are you a lady? Uh, no, ma. It's just that I, I don't want anything. I just want to get it for my wife. Your wife? Yes, my wife. What for? 
Listen, I'm not paying if it's your wife. This is your wife, you love her so much. Madam, I, I love my wife so much. I don't need anything. So, so if you want me to shop, let me just shop for my wife. She would appreciate it. I'm sorry, I'm not paying. In that case, let me wait for you in the car. Come here, you. Come. It's all right. Hmm? No problems. You're free to shop for her. But, nothing more than 50k shopping. That's more than enough. Thank you, Mom. Thank you. Thank you. generous woman. Oh, she's indeed very generous. Do you know I told her I was sacked and then she increased my salary and even offered to get me a car. Ah, baby, a car? <laughs> so, baby, when are you bringing the car home? What do you mean when, when are you bringing the car home? Of course I am not accepting it. What do you take me for? A cheap guy? Chip. Hey, hey, hey. Obina. 
Open okay, so you're not a rich man. Hey, oh, oh, be now your village people have started cooking for you. Village people shall not be well with you. You want to touch my husband, but no, I will show you. Oh, be now. So, your village people now want to put pride in you. They want to put buga in you, Mr. Integrity, so that you chase away your blessing due to pride. What are you talking about? You know I have self-respect, self-esteem. What do you want me to do, take the car? Come on, you know what comes with all this gift? You want to tell me you don't know that nothing goes for nothing? Close your mouth. Close your mouth, you're only being foolish. Hey! Oh God, no, this cannot happen. It cannot. Open now. So you'll be inside this room every day, fasting and praying. Telling God to bless you. And finally, God has sent us a destiny helper. He want to chase her away. What can that kind woman possibly want from you? Tell me. That nice woman that only wants to help you. What do you think she would want from you? Nothing. That woman is a destiny helper sent from heaven. That is all. God wants to bless you through this woman. Obina, please, do not let your foolishness take this blessing away from us. Do you think God will come down from heaven and give you back money? No! He will send you a helper in human form. And that helper is this woman. Are you done? Good night. Good night, where? Obina, listen to me. Listen to me. First thing tomorrow morning, you're going straight to that woman's house to go drive my car back to this compound. You hear me? You're going there to collect everything that that woman offered you. Do you understand me? Are you done? Because you sound like you know this woman already. Good night. Obina, good night. You're a liar. There is no peace for the weekend. You cannot sleep in this room this night. You are not here. Wake up. Wake up so you can understand me. Which one is good night? Have you concluded? Okay, how are you bringing back the car? Wow, that's lovely. Wait, so you mean very soon my friend is going to be a car owner? I'm telling you. Your husband never disappoints. You can't say that again, girlfriend. This guy showers him with so much love. Can you believe Opie does not come home from work each day if he does not get me a gift? Yes. Is it that he's coming home with a luxurious handbag, uh, a designer shoe, a dress, or hair? Just Something exotic. I'm telling you, it's just so much. I don't even know what I Ugo, 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 wait, wait, about. just wait. You mean like every day something? Every day, Betty. Sometimes it is three times a day. Like I just stay home watching TV and a dispatch rider comes to my door and knock. Mother, you have a parcel from your first bag. Uh. Sweetheart, um, I'm thinking of converting our visitor's room into my work closet. Because my wardrobe is so full, you can't take my clothes anymore. You know, fix up the pictures room, place my handbags, my shoes, my boots. They're just so much, I don't know what to do with them. Ah, that's good though. But Ugo, I must tell you the truth. You and I know that Obi is not that buoyant enough to be spending extravagantly. I hope he knows what he's doing. Meaning what? No, meaning what? I don't understand. <sighs> Betty! Are you in any way trying to say my husband is poor or broke? Oh, I see. Betty, you have an eye on my husband. Who will you shut up? Will you shut up your mouth? I'm only trying to advise you as a friend. And stop being childish. Advice a general of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I am here trying to share my testimony as a friend. 
And instead of you to be happy with me, you're hating. Who asked for your opinion, by the way? You asked for my opinion. You did. And moreover, this has not gotten to the extent of you reacting so harsh. Yes, it What's has gotten to that extent. It has. You're jealous of me, Betty. Betty, just wait until my new ride arrives. Okay? You see, this is your black evil heart. It will burst out of your chest and I'll pack it and feed you. I don't blame you, Go. I think you must be very stupid. I've had enough of this, your insult. You and I know too well that Obi cannot get you, Akan. Why are you disturbing that poor boy? Or is it a crime that he got married to you? Can't you cut your coat according to your size? Are you stupid? Madam, size! You have size and yet no man has come to ask for your hand in marriage. <laughs> Isn't that funny? You have size and no man has accepted to marry you. But so what is the essence of your size? But I'm better than you. Up, you must talking. be very stupid. Shut up! Let me finish talking! Because I'm even talking to you, because I brought myself to the low level to talk to you, do you think we're still on the same class? Hey! Ugo. See this girl I'm pitting her lonely life. Ugo. Can you imagine? Ugo, I am better than you. Huh? I am single but better than you. I don't think I have anything to tell you. You must be very stupid. Madam, go and call you pillow. Go and call you your pillow and cry. Can you imagine? You think I have time for low life bitches like you? Any time friendship. My friend, you see these kind of friends, avoid them. They will Someone kill you and marry your husband. I don't understand. I don't want to do it again now. Leave me. And the chapter is saying it's done anymore. Who they do anymore? You get mad. Come for sure. Give me my money before you go. Now your friend should be no original and continue. No problem. Today oh, make you just go. Pack your things. They will thank you for this place. I promise you that. No fish. Nonsense salon. Can you imagine? Because I'm even pitiful to come and patronize you. Nonsense. Can you imagine?